shell mm -hmm. when you break the back of that it breaks the vacuum mm -hmm. and um, allows me to scrape them off the shell and it should if I do it properly it should come right out hey. okay. <laughs> that's the those two are the eyes and that's the mouth and this is what we call the foot it actually sticks that out and crawls along the bottom mm -hmm. okay this part is the skin you don't actually eat this part mm -hmm. Don't eat his eyes or mouth mm -hmm. either. <laughs> and we have to get the stomach and everything out. This is called the skin, it's very tough, so mm -hmm. some people make kung fritters out of it, but it's not good for the salad. How far out are you going now to catch a conch? Uh, I actually go a little ways past Bari Tari. Okay. You know where Bari Tari is? <laughs> We're on out. Yeah, yeah, I've been up there. Yeah. Okay. <coughs> up by the, little, the smaller keys. Yeah. I don't really do it. Um, I just get enough to, for my family and for the restaurant. So. Sure. Salt water to wash it off. Obviously, you want to What you can do. Are you living anywhere by the sea? Yeah, we're on the south side. Okay. What you can do with the shells, because there is still a little bit of conch still inside of them. Okay. And when you, if you took them off land now, the conch that's left in there would, would rot and start to smell. Mm -hmm. So what I what I usually do, um, I just take the shells and put them back in the water for a couple of days. Yeah. And fish in different things. Get they come and get it and take it out. Yeah. It's the easiest way. Hey, you just having a wee there, one. 